me tell you something, folks. Racial slurs are taboo, and we are in desperate need of new ones. And who better to create them than tonight's panel of social engineers? So uh, come up with a new derogatory term that describes any group of people. Jimmy? Well, first of all, I want to say uh, I, I'm so glad you're finally tackling race on this program. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my group uh, is midgets. The hardest time I have with midgets, uh, they don't seem to like anything you call them. You know, They really aren't happy with anything. And when they complain, they have high squeaky voices that give you a headache. Um, I've given this a lot of thought. I'm sensitive to the fact that they want to be called what they want to be called. So I made a huge list and I narrowed it down to uh, uh, three names. Uh, they can be called humanettes, uh, <laughs> halfies, and, um, and or people McNuggets. <laughs> you make the choice, guys. Well, nice. yeah. <laughs> okay, Laura Keitlinger. <laughs> you want to sit on my lap? No, I want you to have the whole because I'm All right. Joke. Okay, first of all, I resent being forced to come up with a sniglet. Ow. Yeah. Uh, but here goes. Titwit. <laughs> it's the tit-shaped candy in a bright pink box. No, titwits are those guys that don't make eye contact while they're talking to you because they're too busy staring at your boobs. <laughs> and when you catch them, they ask... What did your shirt say? <laughs> it says, I know you're staring at my chest, jackass. <laughs> Thanks. Just made it a fun bit. It was great. Okay, Todd Lynn. Yeah, I personally like the slurs we have right now. Why make up something that means the same thing as nigga or redneck or what? I like to know when I'm insulted. Heel nigga, black cracker, chink billy, none of these have the same effect as the good old slurs. I feel like if you want to call somebody a racial slur, do it. Just remember there's going to be either unemployment or a big ass whooping, depending on who you say it to. All right. I like those three, though. Pink, chink billy. Greg Giraldo. Uh, I sat next to a guy in the subway uh, yesterday who smelled like a decomposing flounder. I'd, I'd like to call him and people like him bass holes. <laughs> also, there seems to have been a wave of Asian guys acting like real pricks recently. From that psycho in North Korea to health officials in China to the kids who killed that bouncer here in New York. We should call these guys walk suckers. <laughs> As in, hey, I got no problem with Asian people. I just don't like wok suckers. <laughs> Listen, most Asians are all right. Like Mr. Miyagi, he's cool. But, uh, but Ho Chi Minh, he was a real wok sucker. <laughs> okay. There you go. I guess we could have stopped earlier with the rest of it. <laughs> now we'll go to me. I mean, how later? All right. Mine would be, uh, for whites, you call them men without hops. <laughs> Let me try that. Okay, ready? Uh, All right. Uh, for whites, let's just call them men without hops. <laughs> Black. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> for black. For blacks, the movie ruiners. <laughs> Lati Latinos, Generation Mex. <laughs> and the Asians, the tech supporters. <laughs> wow. You know what, folks? <laughs> if we manage to not offend anybody, I'm sorry. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>